I think Max Wichikumbuzo scammed us all. Now, if you've been following this channel for a while, you know that I've covered Max Wichikumbuzo extensively. I gave the guy the benefit of the doubt and thought that maybe, just maybe, his inventions might be the real deal. But I, like many people, have lost hope. Now, a lot of guys have been getting in touch with me uh, asking about the whereabouts of Max Wichikumbuzo. The truth is that I have no idea. The guy just went missing. Now, I tried to get in touch with the CEO of Saith Technologies, Faith Mungwari, who I usually communicate with, and she is not responding to any of my uh, WhatsApp chats. She's just blue ticking me because I thought that by now we would have maybe even a press release from the Chikumbuzo team, but nothing of that sort has happened. And uh, don't hold your breath. I don't think any communication is coming. Now, I'm by no means trying to dissuade you from supporting Max or Chukumbuzo, but if you take a step back and look, a lot of things are not making sense. We have started commercial, we are in the commercial uh, stage. Starting from tomorrow, we've got small machines. Most of them, they've been bought with these guys who came. We've got guys from DRC, uh, he bought some machines as well. We didn't have much, but right now, we are now in operation. And uh, whoever who wants a machine can now get it. We've got our um, distributor here in Zimbabwe who is going to be handling all the sales in Zimbabwe. So from now going onwards, you can now get the machines. Now, Chikumbuzo had promised the world that his inventions would hit the market in April, I think. But nothing of that sort has happened. His website is still under construction. Now, I'm starting to think that it's either Chikumbuzo has very bad PR or is running a very well calculated scam where he disappears and pops up every few years with an iteration of his self-powered device in quotes and a sob story and we believe him as usual that time dr teddy didn't make it he died in january 2017 i survived by the grace of god uh, so i was always in zimbabwe and united states of america until he heard about myself then he invited the he, president. He, the president, yes. Then he invited me to, 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 to come back and put my base in Zimbabwe. So right now I'm based in Zimbabwe. Well, this time around, I think he had a grand opportunity of disproving all the naysayers. He actually promised himself that he would give uh, journalists an opportunity to drive his uh, uh, Kai Seth vehicle, which is unlimited range. Nothing of that materialized. Not a single journalist got access to any of his other devices, including the power station, right? And he had actually said that in his gadgets or his devices, there was a kill switch. When every, anyone tried to tamper with it, it would, uh, it would be useless. Basically, it would be bricked. But nothing of that sort happened and it's just disappeared. There's no communication taking place. And uh, I think don't get your hopes up with that guy. Uh, I, like many people who are actually believing in him, have lost hope, right? Now, to make matters worse, there are people who are claiming that uh, they had paid Chikumbuzo for the gadgets, which he never delivered, and now he's disappeared, right? It's, it's just not making sense. I think I just have to swallow my pride and accept that I believed in a scam. Get it? Someone like you here coming here and you're, mm -hmm. you're telling us that five years later, this upgrade machine has not been delivered. Correct. And it's not the only one which, which was not delivered. South Africa was not delivered. Yeah. USA was not delivered. So I, we, have, uh, we have scraped the invoices together. Uh, my friend Emmanuel, he has uh, a list of people who paid money and never got any product at all. So the, I'm, I'm very sorry to, to smash the dream of free energy uh, for Zimbabwe. Yeah, so I, I would love... I, I'm the one who would love to see this energy being real and, and being in the market and available for all people. That will be my dream. It's my dream. Yeah. And uh, what is what Maxwell Maxwell is doing is he's abusing uh, the belief of people. I honestly thought that the naysayers were out to get him because he's African and he's coming up with different kinds of inventions. But at this stage. Uh, I've also lost hope uh, with Chikumbuzo. I don't know what you guys think, but I don't think we'll get anything from that guy. It's just all promises and never a single delivery. 
Now, when it pops up a few years from now with another self-powered gadget, I will not waste my time with him, guys. Uh, I'm, I don't know. I'm tired uh, having to defend that guy, right? I, I'm tired. I actually believe that he was the real deal. Turns out he was not. I was scammed. Anyway, maybe I'm just overreacting, guys. Do you think that Chikumbuto is the real deal? Leave a comment down below. If you found this video useful, give it a thumbs up. I'll see you in the next video.